Hello, today I'm going to cook kari ikan merah. Let's start cooking. So these are the ingredients, the, the red snapper, they call it uh, ikan merah. Then I have the bumbu dia. So the bumbu dia is like a halia, kunyit, and serai, and then I blend everything and put inside there. So like what I do, I will marinate the fish for a while. This is the curry powders. So I have like a red chili powder, coriander, fennel, and then like a fish curry powder, kunyit sedikit lah. So I'll mix it up with the water and make like a paste. Of course, I have a santan kelapa, asam. So I says it's like fenugreek, the mustard seed, jintan manis, jintan putih, coriander, and a little bit of black pepper. I'll put in some vegetables like bandy, tomatoes, and uh, terung. Okay, let's start marinating the fish. This is all the. Then taruh sedikit garam juga. Now when you marinate this fish, at least leave it for some time while we are preparing the bumbu and all that so the essence of it will go in so that is the beauty so for this fish curry i like to have the onion to besar besar sikit lah so it's nicer so there is no any proportion what you want to put and all this but ini agak gajah lah because these are the, the small onions which are like got it is like we call it the indian onions you know so we normally like um, no point cut then it all diluted so that's why i'm just Adding in like the besar besar sikit tu cantik lah. I'm going to use uh, like chili hijau. So, so you just blood wah. I think this give kind of a, you know the green chili taste. And tomato. Okay. So this is all done. Then these vegetables all I'll cut later then I'll put it in. You see this bendy is very important. We cannot cut and cook like that. Because there is a kind of a lende. You know keluar dari ni. So what I'm going to do. You know, you like, uh, you got to mix kering lah, jangan pakai minyak apa-apa So that, uh, you know, all the liquid inside dan the lende dia semua jadi dia kering I think it's okay So now, I'm going to pour the minyak So this coconut oil is very healthy as well, so I'm just going to use coconut oil So so this is all my ingredients which I'm going to put inside like I you know the fenugreek, jintan manis, jintan putih, you know, biji sawi, lada hitam dan uh, ketumba. Sekarang I nak masuk ini semua lah, this ingredient. Okay. Ini ketumba ini I nak tumbuh sikit lah. So that the slightly. So you just saruk. Fish curry, I like to have a lot of curry leaves. Let's give a nice flavor. So you cut out skate. So this is bawang besar. I'm just going to two minutes first. Same time, I'm going to put also this uh, chili. Chili hijau. Let it slightly caramelize a little bit, like browner. And now I think we can put also this small onion because this will take some time. Okay, now I'm going to put in a little bit of this bumbu. This is like uh, in a mixture of uh, serai, bunga kantan, halia, kunyit hidup. Yeah. Ni agak gajah lah. Well, ikut terasa kan, but there is no formula how. Ginger taste is a very nice thing, you know, it's very healthy as well. So in between, uh, kita masuk garam sikit lah. So they break. So now you can see the mixture is uh, turning out well, you know, and the oil there pun dah pecah minyak dah. So when the, when you see like you know the thing is separated, then you boleh masukkan tomat sikit. In tomato, tu, I don't want terlalu banyak lah. This is enough. And then I'm going to put the terung. Now the terung also give a kind of a thickens the gravy and all that. So it a nice fragrance. And I like the texture. So now you can see the colors also almost like all my painting color palette. So you have everything here. Yeah. So life is all about colors. You know, you play with colors. I think like when you put in all these colors, you light up your life. These are the curry powders which I have like prepared. A little bit. So now I'm going to mix it up with the water. Then you make it into like a paste. So it's nicely mixed. So I'm going to put everything inside here. Yeah. 
Kita masuk sedikit air Okay So this is the The base for the curry camera So let it cook A boil and then uh, bila cah minyak Then only lah kita boleh masukkan asam jawa And then later part you put the fish See the gravy is too concentrated and very thick So I'm going to put in some water Masuk air sikit Agak gajah lah depend lah berapa orang makan kan You can see the everything in terms of the colors, the texture Everything is coming out well And now let's see uh, Sekarang kita boleh taruh di daun pandan See the daun pandan give a nice fragrance to Jadi pecah sikit supaya dia dia hmm. And then uh, of course This is my favorite uh, daun kunyit So the daun kunyit is the must thing The daun kunyit and also the the coriander So you Potong kecil-kecil je This is a mixture of a daun kunyit and a coriander See what I mean by you know We put a lot of onion And it's all dissolved already Semua dah Dah hancur tu tengok But this comes out nice Sekarang saya nak uh, masukkan asam jawa ya. You know when you cook whatever emotion your mindset of the day goes into the food as well. So that's why I don't believe in using spoon as well. I always say you know mom's cooking always the best. So I follow that lah. So this combination is coming up very well. Let's see macam mana. I think in terms of uh, aroma semua ada dah. Mantap. Nice, savourish. It's good. So, so I'm cooking for my friends, you know, fish curry. At the same time, I, I'm going to makan juga. So what I'm going to do, like, I'm going to take a little portion of it, then I'm going to make a vegetarian curry. Basically, the for vegetarian, the base is the same thing. You can put a mushroom into this, become a mushroom curry. Or you put an egg, become a curry telur. And then you can put kentang and all that, and it becomes something else. So you can put a lot of vegetables. There's no formula to say that, you know, you cannot put anything, you know, this kind of thing. So I think for me it's like I'm making like two in one. So I make a fish curry for my friend. At the same time I take this bumbu, the lau skin. Then later on I will prepare something for myself. Probably I'll put a cendawan. So I make like cendawan curry. I'm going to put in the santan kelapa. Let's put in the fish. This is the ikamera. This is called the red snapper. I already marinate this, but I know still let them cook here for a while, and then that's it. Ini ikan yang dapat hari ni lah. So now we can put the bendi as well. Then I'm going to take a little bit of daun ketumba ni. So ketumba is like is my favorite lah. So like. Uh, This is like more like the Nusantara cooking. Eh? So we always like to add a pinch of a sugar in this. But this one I'm using, you know, the palm sugar. A little bit to give a sweetness to the cooking. So this is actually good, you know, so like uh, it's a very healthy one. So this is like the cradle of fish. So like nicely it's coming out. Okay. It's cooked. So now I'm going to dish it out. So we're going to play makan. Tutup api dia. 